Excellent. Enable the <laughs> All right, lower it down and all right, release the bombs. There's a typhoon shooting me down. What just happened to the engines? Oh god, I, it's on fire. It, it, it's on fire. Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks Search and Destroy video. Today we are checking out a Boeing B-17 Flying Fortress, and it is absolutely amazing. We need to open up this uh, to actually let it out first though, so there it is, and uh, it is looking beautiful. But anyway, we are going to jump inside this thing, we are going to go down the runway this time and take off properly, and we're actually going to go ahead and fly out to an enemy base, which is actually a fishing village, and uh, hopefully blow it up with some bombs. So, yeah, flying out there will give us a chance to actually look at the ball turret. It'll actually give us a chance to look around the entire thing as well. So, let's do it, shall we? Okie dokie, so in order to actually get in, there is a door on the other side, which is this side. We're going to go ahead and jump inside of here, and we are going to close... Oh, we're going to close the door from outside here. There we go, excellent. We have rear gunners, as you guys can see, one here and one here. We have the ball... Oh my, how do I get past this? <laughs> how do I actually get past this? Do I just jump through there into one of those? I have no idea. There we go. Uh, and we're going to try and fly this thing. So I feel like it's going to be kind of tricky, but we'll see. Uh, it's got bombs, as you guys can see. And um, yeah, it's it's actually insane. The amount of detail in this is crazy. But anyway, let's do an engine startup and get this thing moving. Hopefully all will go well uh, and we'll be good to go. Engine startups all the way over there. Excellent. Link all the throttles together. Excellent. Backlights. Yes. Uh, altitude hold on, we don't need that. Flaps, we don't need that right now. Engines, one to four. Turn the parking brake off. Navigation lights. Uh, IFF lights, sure. Cow flaps, let's do it. And let's go. Alright, is this gonna work? Is this actually gonna work? I don't know. Press three? Oh, no, I'm confused. I am now confused. <laughs> I don't know. I wanna go outside, uh, and then I wanna turn right, and we're gonna take off normally. Let's do this. Look at this, it's actually a plane in Stormworks that we can actually see out of. <laughs> Sometimes that is just not something that happens, so that's pretty crazy. Uh, let's do right side brake, press 2. Okay, apparently that's left side brake. I'm going to try and turn right. I'm trying to turn right. I don't know how you do it. <laughs> I don't know how you do it. I'm trying to turn. Okay, I do have an idea on how to do this a bit easier. Go ahead and turn this off. I've got an idea. Okie dokie. So since it is Stormworks, we can actually just run into the rear of the plane. Uh, and that will turn it around. So there you go. That's how you turn it around on a runway in Stormworks. Pretty easy, right? Okay, it is my job to now take off. So here we go. Full throttle on the engines. That is excellent. Enable the <laughs> collector. Okay, so probably enable the collector. <laughs> what am I doing? What was that? I blew up all of the bombs inside of this thing before even taking off. That is insane. All right, not gonna lie, instead of taxiing it again, we are actually just gonna go ahead and take off from here. I'm gonna link the throttles together again, start the fuel pump, start the cross feed, start all of the engines. Uh, I should probably be in that seat to do it, but whatever, it's fine. Um, cool. Engines, throttle up. Actually, press three as well. That'll start us moving, and that was the problem. All right, increase the throttle. Let's go. Um, so yeah, I essentially, like, I, I shocked the bombs into exploding because I was going to take off far too quickly. But there you go, we're actually in the sky. Um, navigation lights, yes. Where's the landing gear button? There it is. Alright, landing gear is going to fold up. Let's have a little look at that. Oh, that looks sick. Yeah, nice. Uh, we're actually flying this beautiful beast. Nice. Okay, so let's get ourselves going in the right direction. Once we're flying in the right direction, we'll have a little look around the inside of this thing. Uh, and then once we get there, we'll drop the bombs and hopefully all will go well. Okie dokie, so we're now flying. Uh, we've got an altitude hold button right here so we can actually get out the seat, which is pretty awesome. We have an oxygen supply right there if we need to use that. I don't know why that is a thing, but sure. Uh, we have a heater right here. We're going to go ahead and turn that on. We have a parachute. We're going to use that. Uh, bomb bay and cockpit lights. Epic. Uh, we have a turret up here that we can actually use to shoot things. If we need to, we can aim up. We can aim down, and we can spin literally all the way around. Just like this. Epic. Uh, if we go forwards underneath the pilots, we can actually go down into this area, which is where the bombardier sits. Uh, with the... Wait, B7? We can actually control it from here. 
that's actually a pretty good design. So we can actually aim where the uh, plane is actually flying from here. There you go. Bombardier gets control. Let's fly left a little bit. Fly right a little bit. Amazing. We have our bomb site right there as well. We have our bomb release, our bomb bay open, our bomb site zoom. We also have our machine guns. And also, I think this is the navigation seat. Yeah, navigator seat. Pretty awesome. Nice. That's epic. We also have a light as well. Crazy. Nice. All right, go ahead and close this up if we can. Awesome. Let's make our way backwards. Wait, actually, why are we so wonky? Why are we flying off to the side? That doesn't make sense. All right, so obviously we got the bombs right here. Let's go ahead and go backwards from there. And back here, we actually have the ammunition. We've got another seat right there. We have a radio as well, just in case we need it. We have a ball turret gunner. Right, how does this work? Uh, turret up, down. Right, so it lowers the turret down. And now we should be able to move this around. Oh, that is sick. I mean, it's... It's a bit buggy, I'm not gonna lie, but that's still really cool. That's awesome. Alright, and fire 50 cals? I can't seem to shoot them for some reason, but sure. Why can't I shoot? I can't shoot the gun. Alright, well anyway, um, lift it back in, please. Oh god. <laughs> I'm struggling with this. There we go, lift it back in. Awesome. Uh, so then we've obviously got the rear guns, as you guys can see right here, and right here. And then if we go even further backwards, we've got the rear gunner, uh, the tail gunner as well. I can't seem to shoot these guns, but that's because there's no ammo. Oh, okay, maybe we need infinite ammunition for this. There we go. So now we can actually shoot them if we need to. Uh, and I'm assuming that... Oh my jeez, Louise. I'm assuming it works the same way for the other one as well. For the ball turret. Alright, lower it down, and... Yeah, it works the same way. That's pretty epic. Alright, lift it back up. We need to get to the front of this. Uh, uh, let me out. I don't know how you get out of this seat. How do we... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. How do I... Maybe this. There we go. To get out of the ball turret, you have to jump into that seat. To get across into there, you have to jump across here. To get through the front of the plane, you got to go this way. Okay. There's a lot of stuff that gets in the way, but that's fine. Pilot seat. Come on. We're flying in the wrong direction. <laughs> it's that way. But yeah, we have pretty much checked out everything in there, so that's actually pretty epic. Uh, the fishing village... Wait, I guess we are almost there. We are actually almost there. Uh, the fishing village is down here somewhere, very close. Uh, and we're going to do a bombing run on it, of course. Um, and yeah, hopefully all goes well. This is going to be amazing. Okie dokie. So I was just reading the, uh, the description of this thing real quick uh, to see what the oxygen thing meant. So if you are actually over 3,300 feet in altitude, you will start to die, apparently. So, yeah, you'll need to turn the oxygen off if you get over that altitude. We won't be doing that today because we are staying at this altitude, which is, what, 2,600 almost? Uh, so that's perfect. All right, cool. We're going backwards. We're going downstairs. We're going to leave that open just in case we need to escape. Uh, and all will be good. All right, excellent. Get to the very front. Sit in the bombardier seat. And get ready. We're going to zoom in. Uh, bomb site zoom. All right, maybe not that much. There we go. Bomb site zoom. Um, okay, awesome. Bomb bay is going to open. There it is. Epic. And we are going to drop the bombs on the target as soon as we get there. All right, give control of this guy. Let's go. I don't know how well this is going to work, but we're going to try it. All right, okay. We're getting very close. All right, I feel like I'm off to the side quite a lot, so let's turn. Turn a bit more. Okay, amazing. We are getting over the fishing village very soon. Here we go. Yeah, okay, okay. Beach is in sight. That's epic. There's a typhoon coming up to shoot me down. <laughs> There's a typhoon shooting me down. It's World War II, my guy. Don't forget it. All right, release the bombs. All right, let's have a little look at this, shall we? have a little look at this. There the bombs go! Amazing! Look at that! That's cool. Alright, so the bombs have been released. Uh, we are now getting shot at by a Eurofighter. It's shooting the bombs, I think. We need to see if they explode. We need to see if they work. So, get back to the pilot seat. Turn this off. There we go. We need to fly this thing properly. If I can get back here, get into the pilot seat. Let's turn it around. This is going to be amazing. Alright. Are the bombs still dropping? I don't see them. I don't see the bombs anywhere. Hopefully we've hit the target. <laughs> Does anyone see them? We're looking for an explosion on the ground. 
there they are. We missed the target by a little bit. That sucks. But it's okay. Right, slow us down. Slow us down a little bit. Okay, I don't know what the plane's doing. It seems to be doing a big bad problem things. Big bad problem things, but that's okay. Alright, turn us around. We're going to fly back over and we're going to try and shoot some of the planes down. Uh, using our guns on board this thing. Probably not a good idea, but we're going to try. Oh my, okay. I almost just fell out of the bomb bay. I forgot it was even open. We need to go close that. Close the bomb bay doors. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Uh, close the bomb bay doors. There we go. Excellent. Now we can go from the back to the front safely. Here we go. Excellent. We need to go to the very back if we possibly can. How do we get back there? How do we get back there? Nobody knows. There we go. Run, 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 run. All the way to the tail gunner. And we need to wait until we see a Eurofighter Typhoon to shoot it down. Yeah. Bad idea, I know, but whatever. It's fine. What was that? What are those things in the water down there? Also, what's shooting at me? I don't know. Okay, so, uh, bombing mission obviously not going to plan. Not really. I mean, we tried. We did try. Uh, but that's okay, because we're still alive. We still need to land this thing. The bombs sort of did... What just happened to the engines? Oh god, it's on fire. It's on fire. <laughs> oh no, okay, right, we need to stop this. I've been in this scenario before. Okay, right, cow flaps, were they even open? I, I don't even know, cow flaps, there we go. Uh, engine throttle. Lower it, okay. Uh, we're gonna have to try and land this thing. Our landing gear has fallen down. Okay, and we are... We're gonna have to attempt a emergency landing while being very on fire. Okay. Okay, as long as we've still got forward thrust, we're good. I don't know where the um, thing is. I'm going to turn the heater off. Oh, God. Pull up. Pull up. Oh, lordy. Okay, we crashed into a, 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 a hill. Now we're crashing into the trees. We're down on the ground. This ain't it. This ain't good. Do we even have a welder? It's so on fire. This is crazy. That's not good. I, I think... Oh, I turned the wrong thing off by accident, and now everything's broken. And we've crashed our B-17 into some trees. But we are alive, so that's good. Literally a B-17 down. This is not good. All right, get to the other side. I put out the fires on this side, but they are going to reignite. We need to open up this door. We need to get inside. I can't get inside like this. Okay. Uh, put out these fires as best we can real quick. I need to get inside to turn the ignition off, but I can't do that because I don't have a welder. We need to find a welder on board this thing. I don't know where it is, though. This is not good. This is not... We're lucky that we even had a fire extinguisher, to be fair. But we need a welder. Oh, my. Okay, well, I'm inside uh, right now, but we are being attacked by the Eurofighter still. It's literally annihilating me. This is not fair. This is just not fair. All right, I need to get past this ball gunner. I need to get to the front. But I can't get there. I can't- I literally can't get past this. Let me through. Let me through! There, right, okay. So, uh, it's still on fire. Luckily we have no bombs on board when we crashed, so that's good. Uh, but we don't have any welder to actually fix this, so I'm not entirely sure what to do. I have a feeling that this would actually make a really good video for the next one. So what I am gonna do is save this. We're gonna try and recover this. We're gonna try and recover it, so... That's what we're going to do in the next video. There's now a warning siren going off. What is happening? Yeah, we're going to try and recover this next time. We are still being shot at. Let me take cover. Oh, let me get underneath. I don't want to die to that. I don't want to die to that. Um, yeah, I'm scared though. <laughs> I'm really scared. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. Okay, so for now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, if you guys do want to see me try and recover this thing, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, but for now, thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Goodbye.